everyone, this is Darren Mann. This is my first video vlog about my transition. This is the, I want to say the second week since I've came out to people. And I've only got like people I can count on one hand who know right now. Um, but they're people who I talk to frequently, so it means a lot to me. Um, yep, so a few of the things that I have been changing right now is I changed my gait. Men, when they walk, they walk with their feet like this, and they walk a lot with their knees. Um, they also use their shoulders a lot less than women do. And w women, they walk a lot with their hips, and they walk with uh, their feet like that. So that was the first thing that I had changed about myself. As you noticed, my voice, I haven't been... I haven't changed too much. One of the things I was told was men are a lot more lazy with their speech. Uh, women tend to overpronunciate, and men we don't do that. So I stopped. I stopped really correcting myself with my speech, and I tried to get lazy with it. I don't know how how else to say that. But um, another thing is, is I wear glasses, so whenever I take a photo or do a vlog, I take my glasses off because they give me a very feminine face. I mean, I look like a girl, yeah. and they're very, very messy right now, so I have to clean those. But uh, oh, and don't think. Uh, this blue thing is going, it, it's going to be um, a constant. Uh, it's just, it's it's just coincidence. I, I mean, I got a blue shirt on. I got um, blue threads in my pants. So uh, it's just a coincidence for this video, but uh, it, it makes sense. <laughs> what else? I don't smile too much with my cheeks anymore because. Cause they give me, they give me the dimples right here, and uh, yeah, that's, that's first of all, it's not too attractive, um, and second of all, it, it curves my face. Um, men don't really have that curvy of a face, so I try not to accentuate those things. I take a lot of my tips from um, drag kings. Uh, I know a lot of you trans men out there don't really like to talk about <laughs> taking tips from drag kings, but uh, some of the drag kings that have been drag king for a while know how to pass, and they know how to do it well, and they know how to transform themselves into a man, even if they go back to being a woman afterwards. Um, a lot of the times you can put eyeshadow here. Or eyeshadow here, just really accentuate the jaw. Um, you can also put some eyeshadow here to give yourself a bit of an Adam's apple. Right now, I don't have any makeup on, so uh, I can't. Uh, I'm not the best of example right now. And what else have I been doing? I've um, I've stopped introducing myself as a trans man. Um, I used to be, I, I used to tell people that I would meet from uh, my friends or whatnot that, hello, my name is Darren, I used to be Stephanie. Um, I don't, I don't do that. Um, mainly because as soon as you tell somebody that, they look at you as you're a woman. And, you know, that's what they look at you like. They look at you like, uh, you're just a woman pretending to be a man. Which, I'm not. I'm, I'm not a woman. Um, definitely a man. And, what else? My coming out party is soon. I decided that instead of telling everybody individually and 
going through those individual bumps and getting hurt individually um, by just the stu stupid questions I'm afraid of like uh, are you sure this is what you want like I I'm pretty sure this is what I want um, yeah I, I, I have a really huge phobia on needles and I would not dream of sticking myself with a needle every single day if this is what, what I wanted um, I'm also afraid of surgery, so uh, there's that. But yeah, instead of telling everybody individually, I decided to hold a party on the 19th. So look for my blog on the 19th for when that's coming out and have that one. Um, yeah, uh, it really feels weird to just say, um, it's a coming out party. I mean, anybody out there know better vernacular I could be using instead of coming out? I mean, it sounds like I'm coming out as a le lesbian again, um, which I'm not anymore. Uh, it's kind of weird to know that I'm coming out of the closet as a straight man. Weird, but that's what I have to do. Um, I'm going to college on the 24th, a dorm in college, I'll be sharing a room with two female roommates who have no idea that they're going to be rooming with a trans man. And probably, that, that probably sounds like a really, really bad ABC sitcom or something like that. Um, but yeah, I'll be introducing myself to my teachers, to the friends I make there, to my roommates as a male and practically nobody will know that I ever was a female. Um, they'll never know that I had a name that that was feminine, I went by female pronouns, I ever wore a dress, um, that I owned pink clothing, uh, that I that I at one point I had my hair dyed pink. Um, so they'll never know that. They'll just know me as Darren, the uh, anime freak. <laughs> so there's that. And yeah. <laughs>